Hey there, welcome back to my channel. This is Jay Johnson with windowpurchase.com. If you're finding me on YouTube for the first time, you can go directly to windowpurchase.com, see over 200 educational videos, see the three books I've published on Windows and Doors since 2008, and I have a consulting page if you need help beyond that. And again, if you find my videos helpful, please like and subscribe. The video I wanna do right now is on you doing something to a window or door as far as color or finish after the fact. Most of the time, this is specifically to the outside. So let me break it down for you. Let's say you buy a product and it's painted whatever color on the outside, or it could be foiled, or it could be capped, however it achieves its color process, okay, is gonna have a lot to do with how long it's warranted for on that finish from fading, uh, blistering, peeling, stuff like that. Now, if the manufacturer's warranty on that finish is not up yet. Let's say it's five years, and at the third year, you think it looks terrible, and you paint over it. You just voided that warranty in most cases because you might not be using the right paint. You might not be that good of a painter. You may not be seal coating it. You might have used an interior paint, what it should have been an exterior paint. Just know that most manufacturers are going to not warranty something if you've done something to it within that warranty period, okay? So I've seen finished warranties from one year to two years to five years to 10 years, 20 years, and the longer that finished warranty is for, usually the better the process is of however they've achieved that color on the exterior. And this is particularly appointment uh, important if you're dealing with exterior foils. I did a video on exterior foils, also known as laminates, and your better ones have a 20-year exterior finish warranty. They're eight times thicker than a painted product, four times thicker than, a, thicker than a cap stock, but more importantly, they're category one on the Delta E scale which basically means they don't show fading for at least 20 years. You can watch another video I did on a Delta E scale. The other thing is those foils are made up of three layers and the base layer is white. And what that white layer does is it reflects the heat back off the frame, especially important when you're dealing with darker colors, black, bronze, stuff like that. So you could have two black colors right next to each other, for example, and assume that they're the same temperature on a hot day. But if one's a foil with that reflective material reflecting the heat back off the frame and the other one is not, you're more likely to see fading on this one. You're more likely to see possible warping on the window because it's getting a lot of excessive heat because of the outside exterior finish. Again, once you get something, don't go messing with it if you don't have to, if it's still within manufacturer's warranty. Otherwise, you're probably going to avoid the warranty. And this also leads into glass. One of the big brand names on the market, um, it specifically states in their warranty, if you put any aftermarket window film on the glass, it voids the warranty. It doesn't have the word tint. It doesn't have the word dark. It literally says any aftermarket window film. If you add any on that glass after you buy it, you just voided the warranty. Anyway, I'm Jay Johnson, windowpurchase.com. I hope you found this video helpful.